Hi guys, um, for you, I'll be guiding you on how to write your thesis, especially for lab analysis, results and discussion section. So when you write the thesis, the results and discussion sections can be both interesting and most challenging sections to write. For Unimap students, um, both sections are combined into a single chapter. Um, the good part is, um, it's easier to combine both results and discussion because the two are closely connected. The results section should set out your key experimental results, um, including any statistical analysis. You should cover any literature, literature supporting your interpretation of significance. And the most important thing is, you should write your results section in the past tense. Every result included must have a method set out in the method section. Conversely, every method should also have some results given. If you are unsure whether to include certain results, then review your research questions and decide whether the results are relevant. Please do not copy-paste um, anything onto your thesis. You also need to consider how to present your results um, using tables, using figures, using graphs or text. Try to use a variety of different methods of presentation and consider your reader. 20 pages of dense tables are hard to understand as are 5 pages of graphs. Make sure that each table in figure has a number and a title on it. So top tips guys, um, summarize your results in the text, drawing on figures and tables to illustrate your points. Um, the text and figures should be complementary and not repetitive. Discussion section. This section has four purposes. It should interpret and explain your results. It should answer your research question. It should justify your approaches. It should critically evaluate your study. The discussion section therefore needs to be reviewed. You also need to demonstrate that you understand the limitations of your research and the implications. If your results are controversial, and or unexpected, you should set them fully in context. You do not need to be apologetic about these because you made a choice about them, which you should have justified in the methodology section. At this stage, you may want to revisit your literature review. Um, so this is an example of how you can write your results in discussion section. Um, you should guide your reader by telling them that this chapter is divided into few sections. This is an example of um, how to report your results, how to present your figure with number and title of figure included. So this is an example of how you report your results, how you conclude your results, how you support your results with facts and how you compare with you compare your results with other researchers. If you want to make it more oomph, um, you can um, put a graph. You, you, you can present sorry. You can present your results on the table, and you can compare with other researchers and include your study on it. In it. In it. So, um, CC stands for True Happiness Ended Since It Started. I hope you have started to write your thesis and hopefully at the end of your writings you will definitely find your true happiness. Okay guys, um, that is all for me. I'll be seeing you again virtually next week. Um, I've missed you already. Um, sincerely, sincerely yours. Love you guys. Miss you. Bye.